this morning to express our faith in a candidate for mayor who shares our vision for transformation. And that candidate is Cook County Commissioner Brandon Johnson. And I feel a real connection with Brandon. I know he used to be a teacher in Cabrini Green, and he lives on the west side. He lived it. He gets it. That's right. I know that Brandon understands the struggle of everyday life with limited resources because I got the chance to talk to him. Every time he comes to support my union members or my community, whether he's on a strike line or he fighting for community funding or PPE, he makes time to talk to me and everyone else. So when the pandemic happened, and those of us like myself that are frontline workers and we were out there and we were struggling fighting for PPE and other resources, guess what? Brandon came out there, he stood with us, he made his voice unified with ours so that we can win, and we did, right. to get what we needed collectively. Right. Tell me that's not something you need. All right. Brandon Johnson is a former teacher and he's also a parent, so that means he knows the struggle. And in all his work, Brandon makes it clear that he understands the importance of childcare. He gets it, that children need and deserve quality childcare. And that parents need affordable childcare. Yeah, yeah. Chicago can fulfill its promise as a world-class city if it makes sure that stakeholders have a legitimate real seat at the table to solve this challenge that we're experiencing right now, public safety. That's right. And home health care workers, child care workers, workers in hospitals, not only do you have a seat at the table, when I'm the mayor of Chicago, you actually get to help to set the table. No, because for too long, the interests of corporations have controlled the outcome of this city, and it has failed miserably. So now it's time that the workers rise up. You get to not only elect me, but you actually help, you get to help lead this city. And as the next mayor of Chicago, I can give you this promise that not only will your voices be heard, but the people of Chicago, your voices will be heard because SEIU, HCII, you are the voices of Chicago. You're the people who are gonna bring the type of economic justice that this city has long deserved, that the wealthy and the ruling class, you're gonna have to pay your fair share. To ensure a new revived city, we have to make sure that whether you are on the southeast side of Chicago, the west side of Chicago, the south side of Chicago, no matter where you are, from the first war to the 50th war, and everywhere in between, the working class, we're bringing a revival to this city. And we will not be silenced anymore. So thank you, SEIU, ACRI. Let's go to the fifth floor.